Hey everybody, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the scene explain ChatGPT plugin that basically lets you upload images to ChatGPT and interact with those images. So you can use images in your ChatGPT prompts, and then you can use that image input to generate Facebook ad copy, social media captions, and a lot of other applications as well. So before I would show you how to use this scene explain ChatGPT plugin, first, let's see some of the use cases. So my website, rohex.com I have a full article on how to use the scene explain ChatGPT plugin and in that article I talk about some of the best prompts you can use this plugin with and also some use cases so let's go over briefly some of the use cases so as you can read here you can use the scene explain ChatGPT plugin to do image analysis so you can analyze images to understand the content of that image this could be useful in a variety of contexts such as understanding the content of a photo or a piece of artwork. You can use it to identify objects within an image. So this could be useful for people who are visually impaired or for applications that require object recognition. You can use it for content moderation, so checking image for inappropriate content. You can use it for image-based search, educational purposes, accessibility, and so on and so forth. So if you want to get this full article with the best ChatGPT prompts, make sure to check out the article in the description below. And you can also get access to a complete database of all currently available ChatGPT plugins that can be installed from the ChatGPT plugin store. You can search this plugin database by category, plugin name, description, and get quick access to ChatGPT plugin video tutorials, the best use cases and prompts for all available ChatGPT plugins. The database can be downloaded for free, but you can also support the maintenance and the frequent updates of the database with a small donation. Any support is appreciated. You can get access to this database by using the link in the description below. Right, but now let's see how to use the scene explain ChatGPT plugin. So before you would be able to use the plugin, if you haven't used the plugin before, there is a process you have to go through. It's a really easy process, so I'm not gonna go over all the steps. If you do not know any of the steps, make sure to check out my other YouTube tutorials on my YouTube channel that explains each of these steps. But let's go over quickly each of these steps. So first you have to be a plus subscriber to be able to access and use ChatGPT plugins. Then you also have to enable plugins in your ChatGPT account. Then you have to click on new chat and make sure to select GPT-4 from the model selector. Then hover over GPT-4 and select plugins from the list. Then we have to enable the plugin. To enable the scene explain ChatGPT plugin, first we have to install the plugin. As you can see, for me it's already installed, but if you haven't installed it yet, you have to click on plugin store, search for the plugin and install the plugin. And last but not least, once the plugin is installed, you also have to enable the plugin to be able to interact with it in ChatGPT. And to enable a plugin, all you have to do is check the checkbox next to the name of the plugin. Right now, let's see an example on how to use the scene explain ChatGPT plugin. So first we need an image and one of the limitations of ChatGPT is that you cannot upload an image or photo directly from your computer. So you have to use an image that is available in the internet. And once you find that image, or you can just upload your image to a public website and then use that image from there, then all you have to do is right click on the image and select copy image address. Then go back to ChatGPT and add the following prompt. So we're gonna use a really simple, a super simple prompt. Explain to me what is on this image. And then we have added the URL of that image or photo if we want to ChatGPT to explain to us what is on that image. Of course, you can make this prompt more advanced. As I mentioned, I have a tutorial on this on my website. But first, we just wanna see if ChatGPT is able to describe us what is on this image. So as you can see, you don't have to use any kind of function, just natural language is enough. And ChatGPT is clever enough to know that it has to use this scene explain ChatGPT plugin. As you can see, it has inputted the image URL. And now let's see if it is able to recognize what is on this image. So this is the full description we have received from ChatGPT with the scene explain plugin. So as you can see, the image provided is a portrait of a young couple posed against a royal blue background surrounded by cash. So if we check the image, so far it's absolutely correct. Both the man and the woman are wearing sunglasses and hats and they are both grinning. The woman is wearing earbuds, a light blue tank top with white stripes and a white brim straw hat and black skinny jeans. 
So as you can see, it is not absolutely 100% correct. So as you can see, ChatGPT can hallucinate some stuff. So black skinny chains isn't really visible on the image. So all in all, the plugin is not perfect, but as you can see, it will get you a good overview of what is on this image. So it's not 100% perfect, So, but you can use this, for instance, for generating social media caption. So let's do that. So I have added the prompt based on this description, generate us social media captions for Instagram. Then click on generate and using that description of the image, it's going to give us some good social media captions that are engaging and can use on our social media and Instagram posts. So this is just one application of this Scene Explain ChatGPT plugin. But all in all, this is how to access and use this Scene Explain ChatGPT plugin to interact with images and use images in your ChatGPT prompt. If you want to learn more about other very interesting and exciting ChatGPT plugins, make sure to check out my YouTube channel where I have a ton of tutorials on ChatGPT and especially ChatGPT plugins. And I have a ton of tutorial coming up on ChatGPT plugins. If you want to learn more about the Scene Explain ChatGPT plugin, you can also check out the tutorial in the description below. And also, if you want to get access to the complete ChatGPT plugin database that includes categories, searchable descriptions, and more, you can also find the link to that in the video description below.